Hello, and welcome to this week's Redskin Roundup. I'm Jordan Waddell. And I'm Dylan Gibson. Thanks for joining us. Let's start today's show with this week's mystery senior. Here's Indica Bono. We're featuring two new seniors this week. Can you guess who they are? This week's mystery seniors are Carly Blessing and Caden Wallets. Back to you. Last week, we introduced everybody to Miss Gephardt, our new guidance counselor. And today, we're featuring our new government teacher, Miss Hill. Ty Thomas has more. Mrs. Hill graduated from Huron High School and was a member of the state volleyball team. She lived in Portland for 12 years and has two daughters. Annie is one and Emma is four. They love playing outside, reading, and baking together. Welcome, Mrs. Hill. It's time now for This Week in History. Here's Logan Tupa. On September 22nd, 1862, President Abraham Lincoln issued the Emancipation Proclamation, which set a date for freeing more than 3 million slaves in the United States. To wrap things up, here are a few important reminders from this past week's announcements. Freshmen and sophomores, make sure you've completed the form to vote for your class officers. The deadline is 2.30 today. Seniors, the Elks Most Valuable Student Scholarship application is due November 14th. And finally, homecoming attendant applications are in the main office and are due next Wednesday, September 28th. Best of luck to our sports team competing this weekend. The football team will be at Edison tonight. On Saturday, the cross country teams will compete in the streak invite. JV football is home versus Edison. And the tennis team hosts the SBC tournament. Well, that wraps it up for this week's Redskin Roundup. Have a great weekend, everyone. Thank you, BCA!